Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to your New York Islanders franchise mode. So, in the last one we simmed up to this point, we have a game in hand on the Flyers. We are one game out of the playoffs. Now, some interesting things happening in the lineup. This is clearly going to be our top line moving forward. White, Lefevre, and Mayer. That being said, we need more guys through here to be able to... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? To be able to score, essentially. Um, going to be honest with you, that, I would be happy with that. If we could find somebody to take over for Gru here. Um, and Dvorsky, I'm, I'm looking at trading. There's no one to shoot here. He's making too much money for someone who doesn't shoot and to be on a second line. Um, defensively, I feel all right. In goal, I feel okay. Um, yeah, because in the AHL next year, it's going to be Cousins as that backup goalie. In fact, I might even do that now. And I make Cousins the backup goalie now. DeVry probably on his way out. 21 years old. Has a lot of trade value. That's someone that we could be able to find a, uh, a trade partner with. But to be honest with you, I have somebody in mind. I have a couple players in mind uh, to fill out that top six. So, let's get into the trade deadline here. We're going to keep current trade block. And we're going to enter the trade deadline. Now the team, first thing I want to do actually is just probably take a look here. Cole Caulfield. I don't love that. But I do know Cole Caulfield shoots the puck, right? Let's take a look at him. Uh, 18 goals. Does he not Does he not shoot the puck? I mean, look, the guy that we have as our gold standard of shooting the puck, Mayer. How many shots does Mayer have this year? 200 already. Yeah, Cole Caulfield we're not going to use. Um, there's a couple guys, though, specifically on the St. Louis Blues. One happening to be a familiar face. Haltonen. I want Haltonen and I want Caswell. I do. I want those two to fill out my top six here. That being said, it's going to take some big trade options. Dvorsky obviously is getting moved over there. Uh, we're definitely going to throw DeVry. I think that's probably the best option that we really have there with him. Uh, in terms of other guys, you know, I think that we have to look towards the goalies. Um, one or even two of them could be gone. I think that's probably our best option. Uh, uh, who else? I, I would trade Zaitsev. Yeah. Let's see. What does that look like? St. Louis has more. They have too many skaters. Okay. Give me, give me Dickinson then. Rejected. Okay. I would go as far as to offer my first round pick this year with this. Rejected. Okay. So I'm going to be honest with you. I think Caswell is the reasoning. So we're going to take him off. I would do one for one that. But I also am going to safeguard it with a couple thirds just to, you know, see what happens. Rejected. Okay. Straight up. Reject. Okay. Uh, that being said, we have no other picks besides our first this year. We are going to throw DeVry in there. And I want a second and a third as well. Oh, and I'll take uh, I'll take one of those skaters you don't want. Rejected. Get rid of the third. Rejected. If I make it a uh, third instead, would you do that? Still rejected. What about just that? Accepted. Okay. Halton, and I, Halton shoots the puck. I can promise you that. We can go look at him right now to make you all feel better about it because I know that there's going to be at least one person down there. Oh, my God. We don't know. I looked at all this stuff before I, I did this. Uh, Halton and down here. 28 goals in the year, which isn't bad. 211 shots. That's a very solid total. It's going to be a second-line sniper for us. I feel good about it. Now, let's get into the rest of the guys that I want to try to find. We're going to look at the trade dead, or the trade block here. Uh, I just want to look at all available, right? We're looking for another guy who could be a top six guy who has X factors. Cole Caulfield is an option. Not one that I love, but an option. Hillen, I uh, no, because he has no contract. I mean, do we trade back for Matt Duchesne again on a one-year? It, I mean, maybe. Connor Hellebuck, 
83. Oh my gosh, who's offering me a trade? Tan and Zaitsev for Schmaltz. Ah, no. That, de that deal for Schmaltz is absolutely horrific. So, the two guys that I'm currently looking at, I, I mean, honestly, it's one guy that I'm really looking at right now. I do think Matt Duchesne, it's not the worst option. Not the worst option. We've got to keep in mind, he's going to be a second to third liner, all depending on where we want to play him. Um, but what are we willing to give up for him is really the question. Um, and it's a good question. <laughs> I would trade this guy, Kondratev. Kondrat uh, Lebedev, Hemingway. I'd trade those three. Heck, I'd only trade those two. That'll go through. Boom. I'm very happy to have... Uh, very, very happy to have added Matt Duchesne. Anything else that I would want to add this trade deadline? Um, another goalie could be something interesting. Troy Terry, two years. Don't love that. Really just, I mean, X-Fact. What's he looking like this year? Let me ask that. Not awful. Definitely not what he was. Where is he? Hellbuck, okay. Keep going from here and be able to see. Mark Stone. That's interesting. Uh, just looking for another X Factor at this point. Like, that's really what I want to find. More X Factor guys. Doesn't look like we're going to find any, so I'm going to go. And take a look. Nope, too far. Take a look at Mark Stone. What's up with him? Not Jake Bean. He's part of the, the Vegas Golden Knights. Stone, 82 overall. Ah, can't do that. Cannot do that. Dostal's an 85 on a one-year deal. Yeah, we'll do that. As long as his stats this season are solid, let's take a look. They're not very good. Last year they were good. I... What's it going to take to get him? That's really what it comes down to. Rookie skaters, oh, rookie goalies, honestly. I traded this guy for like Dostal and like Dostal a fourth and a fifth. Dostal and a fourth for this guy. Deal. Okay. I'm happy with that. I think we're going to call that our trade deadline. I'm sure there was going to be some other big moves that could have happened. Um, yeah, as you see there. Semyon Verlamov. Yeah, 75. No, I'm good. Okay. We need to do roster moves because we got to figure some stuff out. we got to figure some stuff out now. Um, in the system, Haltonen needs to come up. So it's going to be someone who has to clear waivers for sure. Um, I would, like, Bowers and Paling, I both want to be up here. Ah, and Dickinson. So we'll throw Paling down. No one's going to take 1.5 mil. If they do, they do. In goal, uh, we're going to send down Lennox in the NHL now. In terms of forwards... It's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. On defense, it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Because Soderstrom is injured, he doesn't count, so perfect. Best NHL lines, we'll go through and do those real quick, because this needs to be a playoff push team. It has to be. Top line, that's cute. We're not doing that, unfortunately, so... This is what we're going to run. Um, might even get to this, to be perfectly honest with you. Take the load off of McKenna a bit. What are you What are you looking like um, stats-wise this year? 20 and 40, 60. Okay, 13 and 20. Yeah, we're going to put Duchesne up there. Um, 
definitely don't want you here. I want Bowers here. Looks better at face-offs. 80. 74. Cool. Defense. It is what it is. Power play. Uh, in front of the net, I want uh, I want Mayer down there. Your lefty, you're going to go over here. Barzell can go over there. And Lefevre in the middle. Distributor is going to be Lefevre. White will be the finisher. Puck carrier will be Mayer. There we go. Power play line two. Distributor is going to be McKenna. Finisher is going to be Haltonen. And entrance will be Haltonen as well. That being said, you are a righty. You're going to go there. Wallstrom can go up top. Uh, you have the big tipper, so you can be in front of the net. Perfect. Power play line two. Uh, we don't need those. Cool. Penalty kill. Dickinson and Bowers on the same one. Don't want that. I'm going to go here. I'm going to put, uh, not Wallstrom, Holmstrom there. Beautiful. This right here is going to be Dickinson. And this will be um, you know what? No, we will make it Barzell. I take it back. And we'll put him up there. Boom. Penalty kill line three doesn't hopefully matter too much. Goalies. Swayman and Dostal. Alright. It's a big few weeks. It really is. It's going to be crucial to see how this team does in the long term. Because I'm not going to lie, guys. This seat is not only hot, it's to the point where if I have a water bottle sitting below me, it's going to be boiling. So, I'm going to go a week at a time here. Big game against Boston. We get a W. Oh, that, that's not good. That's a lot of L's. They have one game. They, oh, that's not good. Come on, guys. Simulate. Win. Win, please. Okay. It aligns. Defense. Manson, you're going to hop out for Soderstrom. Offense, we're going to go ahead and switch McKenna and him. That's a win. Cool. We need at least two wins out of these three games. <sighs> three wins. 73 points. We're in the playoffs. We're in the playoff picture. Everyone, everyone calm. We're in the playoff picture, though. Two big games against Capitals. A win. And a win! A loss against Seattle, but that's fine. Those games against the Capitals are going to be massive. We're tied with the Capitals on points. Finish out the month here. Get, come on, we need wins. We need wins. Wins. Let's go! 81 points. Currently in the NHL playoff picture. It's, it's between us and the Capitals from the looks of things. We're going to go game by game here. Soderstrom is injured. That's unsurprising, to be perfectly honest. Manson, get in there. A win. Come on, win. Good, we have a big, we have uh, not a big gap, but we have a divisional playoff spot now. Ottawa here. A loss, it's fine, it's fine. Got to bounce back, though. Got to beat Detroit. Oh, no, 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 no. New York, please, 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 please. Soderstrom, good. Good timing, Soderstrom. Really good timing. Defense, Manson. Put in Soderstrom. A win. Let's go. 87. 87, okay. Against the Jets here, we need a win. We get a shootout win. We'll take that. Decent gap here now. A loss. They have two games in hand. We we need a point here against against Florida. We need one. Oh no. 89. We're in! We're in the playoffs! Let's go! Oh my god. It only took a year and a half. Well, yeah, I can't even say this. What is this? Year five? 2029. This is year like seven. Oh my lord. Let's go through the stats. 95 points for Barzell. 88 for Lefevre. 81 for White, 78 for Mayer. 46 and 45 goals on the same line is insane. 77 for Duchesne, so 17 points since he came here. 
73 for Halton, and I don't know how many since he came here. Um, middle stat there with 55, McKenna with 52, Wallstrom with 45. Holy cow. Goalies. Swayman played okay, not great. Dostal did the same. I'm just so happy that we're in the playoffs. I can get something off my back now. I can relax a little bit. Oh my gosh. that This has been a very stressful episode, but you know what? It worked. That's all that matters. So, if you guys enjoyed this one, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys in the next one when we finally get into the playoffs. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace out and good.